What is up everybody, Darkwater Rose, and today is a video that really should have been posted a long time ago, but I deleted that version. I'm making a new one right now as we speak. Uh, it's about the channel, what's been going on for the past few days. I don't know if I said it in, actually no, I could not have because I deleted that video. I'm being... My mind has been screwed over by math, so, yeah. You're gonna have to bear with me on that. I think I'm just gonna do something. Yeah, never mind, I won't. I parked at the one side of the, my school where you have to drive down the long drive of shame just to reach an exit. But uh, I'm gonna start off. Recently, uh, Windows 10 had an update for October that deleted files. And I had no choice but to update. My computer froze, I had to turn it off. And in the process, the update was installed, which this is on my laptop. So that's where the majority of all the games are. But what happened was it erased my sound driver, so it didn't register I had speakers or anything. And I was searching how to fix it. I was going through and downloading sound drivers from the device manufacturer. And that didn't work. I went through and troubleshooted. That didn't work. I tried going to a previous update, but they instantly, the moment the October update was installed, they deleted the previous one. Which is not supposed to happen. It was supposed to last for 10 days, but I guess that's what happens when the files were erased. So I had only two options, one of which was wait for the next update to come out or reset my computer. So all day Saturday I had reset my computer, or was resetting, and that led me waiting all day Sunday for everything I had on it to be reinstalled. So in the process, I lost three ARC videos because they were too large to be transferred by anything I was using. And uh, I also, well that was it, I think I just had three ARC videos since I don't have anything else I can record on that laptop yet. But now I, uh, now everything's up there, it's just I haven't had the time to record. Like yesterday I was going to, but I failed to hit the record button and then uh, everybody I was recording with all left after 20 minutes because, well, we kind of did everything before we even wanted, like we were all going to do this and then uh, it was already there, we were done, we just didn't look hard enough. So now we're, uh, I have some other things to do. I do need to get on and show what's been going on with my side of the game. I'm going to leave what's done with Brian's side to Brian. I'm not going to do any of that. Because quite honestly, every time I try that, it feels like my computer broke. And so with that, uh... That's what you guys can be looking out on for ARC. This is all on ARC side, mind you. Uh, I'm trying to find trustworthy people to do a new series with. Uh, I could probably speed up a bit. But uh, I have a new series in mind. I'm trying to find people who are trustworthy, who I know will follow like the guidelines I have set. And... Uh, who won't, like, just disregard everything that my channel kind of 
is a family friendly channel so the language has to be kept within that restriction and then uh, with that then I can do this new series because it's a multiplayer series it's not single player I might have another series coming up I have recorded but then uh, me and everybody else I was recording with we got rid of it and we're now adding one more member so uh, that's going on the blue cube server I haven't been on recently I've been Well, to be honest, I haven't been doing much for Blue Cube yet. I've been waiting to try and get a group together before I start doing what I'm doing. Which, at the rate we're going, I might as well just finish what I'm doing and then just say, Hey guys, I gave you time to join. Uh, the Skyrim series, I just keep on forgetting about it. I'm not quitting it, I just keep forgetting that it's there. I look at Skyrim and I'm like, I just played you on my Xbox and I don't want to play you now. Uh, the Dungeon Siege games that I've been saying I want to record, I have yet to install to any of my computers. And then there's Fate, who I have yet to install to a computer. Because I'm looking at it and I'm trying to decide if I throw it on this computer, there's the risk of no more memory for recordings. If I throw it on this computer, there's just so much crap on it. So I have to weigh which computer would be the best choice since both of them can run these games with ease. So I just have to decide which is my better choice of the two. Morrowind series I haven't forgotten about. I just haven't been on that computer in the longest time, actually. But yeah, that's that's what's going on. I mean, I haven't forgotten I have a channel. I just don't have the time. I'm getting like 40 plus hours a week with work because we have stuff that are do so early. Everybody's calling in, requesting work from us before winter kicks in where you have to fight snow just to get it done. Snow, ice, all those sort of things winter brings. And then there's, uh, There's also a class that's not going so well for me. It's one class, but the teacher can, he's not a good teacher. I have, I'm gonna to have to resort to my textbook. That's how bad the class is going. So that's gonna consume a lot of time. Because normally for me, I don't need to study to pass a test. I commit everything to memory. I'll make mistakes every now and again, but like I usually can walk away with on a test with at minimum a C minus. These tests I've taken, the C minus isn't gonna do. My first test I had confidence in I would be getting higher than a D. This next test I, well, the test I just recently took, I was like, I'm confident I'm getting a B, and I looked and I got a C minus. So this is going to probably be the first class since, oh, I don't even know, sixth grade that I've actually had to study for. Because if I fail this class, I'm not graduating this year, or this school year, which means I have to wait even longer before I can go to my university and get my degree there, 
which means I spend more money on classes that I don't want to take. Or I shouldn't have to take. But that's what's going on there. That's like, that's the main reason. I just do not have the time anymore. When I do have time, it's usually consumed by housework and uh, just de-stressing from the day. But uh, yeah, that's, that's what's going on. I mean, other than that, I have my Xbox Mixer account that I can do, but the only game that I'd be interesting li interested in live streaming would be the newest Assassin's Creed, and that's it. And since this channel I really don't care about, I really wish I could change it back to how it originally was. I'm just sitting here like, yeah, if I live stream, it's not going to be for much or long. And there goes the blankets in the back of my... I was hawking like crazy. So I have no idea what's going on, but if you guys heard me say a bad word, that is because somebody is honking because I'm coming up on a red light. you guys don't like the fact that I'm breaking for a red light, you can go somewhere else. Now, if the person knows me, that's a different story, but I don't know who this person was, because they were looking right at me. a case of mistaken identity or something, but... Yeah, red light means stop. It doesn't mean go through. I'm not... I'm not in the mood to die today. I blow a red light and my mother figures that out and learns I am going to be erased from the planet. following, that's for sure. I wonder if they weren't happy that I went into the lane that I always take when I'm going home, and I was not supposed to take this route. I'm just going to put that behind me. But yeah, and then, uh, let's see, we're going back on to stuff that I've recorded. The Oblivion series, oh, I haven't forgotten about that. It's in the same boat as every other game. It's time. Non-modded Oblivion, which is kind of like one thing that won't make the game interesting for people is like vanilla. You can just easily play it. The mods, though, is what make the game fun, but like I said, I only install the same few mods. I don't do anything, like, 
think one of the mods I saw gave you overpowered stuff or added a new survival aspect. I'm not really interested in those. Game breaking items I easily do on my own. I mean, if you've seen the first Oblivion video, you saw Ghoulie and I've already broken his game just with what he wears. Skyrim though, it's uh... I could put mods, but the only mods I'm interested in are the ones that are on my Xbox. And as of right now, I'm going to hold off putting those in because I need to figure out if one of my mods has broke a quest or if it's the actual game itself. When I figure that out, then I'll know if I can put mods or not, which I might have to do a off character and get them to that point where I can figure it out. But yeah, that's that's what's going on for me. Okay, one, two, three, you just stopped, I've been stopped. Apparently you don't know what a turn signal is either. I can probably tell you I'm probably the only person in my town who knows what a turn signal is and how to use it. And also what the speed limit means. It's kind of sad. With the turn signal, you don't even know if the person's turning or not, so you're both looking at each other like, what are you doing? When one person goes, the other tries to go, and you're just looking at each other like, okay, one of us is going to do something. That person just disappeared. Or they slowed down, one of the two. Probably turns without using a turn signal again. Alright, am I going to get honked out for stopping at a stop sign? One, two, three. Oh, that person knew what a turn signal was. Wow, okay, I'm, I'm mistaken. How often do you use it? Ah, I have like maybe a good three more minutes before I get home. Oh, okay, there was something in the road. stop signs I get to go through. I am really going to need to put something in the back of my car to stop those stupid blankets in its container from sliding around. If you guys hear it, then you know how annoying it's going to get. Or how annoying it's gotten. Every time I stop, I think I hit something. did in my previous video that got deleted. Um, 
All right, normally with what I do is I usually respond back to messages instantly or when I get a notification that they pop up. So when it comes to like somebody who's newly subscribed and they mention it, I usually message back. And I haven't had the time to do that, but with this video, any new subscriber, this is the hello, welcome, and thank you uh, video. This is like the comment that you would have received if I had the time to actually respond instead of dedicating it to school and work. But with that, um, I, I, I'm not ignoring you guys, I see you, it's just, as I've said, I can't stress it enough that I have my personal life that interferes with a lot of things. So whenever I do get free time, it's either spent, like, housework, or talking with friends, and doing a recording, so that's all what's going on in there. Let's avoid whatever's in the middle of this road because I thought I ran over glass a few days ago and heard something pop. It wasn't a tire, so I hope it was just a poor little stick. One, two, three, since none of you got here, and you better stop because if you hit me, I'm not going to be happy. parking lot. Alright. So making this final turn and then I am going to see you guys later. This video is going to be uploaded like right now when I get within range of my internet. So with that, that's what's going on, guys. Uh, like, comment, share, subscribe. Do those wonderful things you guys do. And in the meantime, I will see you in the next recording. I don't know when that will be, what that will be. But there will be one for sure. So with that, see you guys later.